Hey everyone, how are you? Welcome to another question and answer session for MRCS exam. This is the question. A 52 years old female post hysterectomy attends to clinic. She reports pain and reduced sensation over the medial aspect of her thigh. Clinically, thigh adduction is weak. What is the most likely nerve injury? So, first of all, we can see here that the patient undergone is straight to me that means the removal of the uterus and now she reports that pain and reduced sensation over the medial aspect of the thigh, thigh that means a nerve who is close to the uterus and it may be damaged during the hysterectomy procedure for this pain and reduced sensation occurs at the medial aspect of her thigh and clinically thigh adduction is weak so we have to find out the nerve injury possible nerve injury so first of all this point reduce sensation to the medial aspect of the thigh then in option two that adduction is weak and clue here that the it is it occurred after hysterectomy procedure that means the removal of the uterus so we have to find out a nerve which is very close to the uterus and it may be damaged during this procedure so here are the options options are obturator nerve sciatic nerve femoral nerve number three cord compression and deep peroneal nerve so let's say some of the picture so here we can see this is a picture actually this picture is uh, shown in male patient but uh, here we can see this is the medial aspect of the thigh and this medial aspect of the thigh it is supplied by the cutaneous branch and this cutaneous branch it arises from this nerve which is the obturator nerve and the second picture also here we can see this is the obturator nerve and this obturator nerve it supplies the medial aspect of the thigh so medial aspect of the thigh uh, is supplied by the cutaneous branch of this nerve which is the obturator nerve and we can see the obturator nerve it is very close to midline that means after arising it is more medial so uterus is usually present in this area so during hysterectomy procedure obturator nerve may be damaged and in this picture also here we can see this is the obturator nerve obturator nerve lies most medially then other nerve from the lumbar plexus such as here we can see this is the femoral nerve this is the lateral femoral cutaneous nerve here genito femoral ilio inguinal ilio hypogastric they are the branch from the lumbar plexus but all are located laterally but obturator nerve it lies more more medially and we know that the obturator nerve it supplies the adductor group of the muscle for this the adduction of the thigh will be reduced or damaged so here this is another picture though it is uh, shown in male patient but it is also true in case of female patient that the cutaneous branch of the obturator nerve it supplies the medial aspect of the thigh so it is our answer is now ready that in case the female post hysterectomy status obturator nerve damage and this obturator nerve as it provides sensation in the medial aspect of the thigh so it is damaged as and for this reason adduction of the thigh also reduced because the obturator nerve it also responsible for adduction of the thigh and other options here such as the sciatic nerve sciatic nerve it is the extensor uh, nerve then femoral nerve it uh, is present in the anterior aspect of the thigh then l3 quad compression not true deep peroneal nerve it is the nerve deep peroneal nerve it is nerve of the leg so our answer is the obturator nerve thank you for